Hey guys, I'm Tori Sterling. Welcome back to my channel. So today I'm doing another video in my Hooded Eyes series. I haven't done one of these in a really long time, but you guys always seem to really like this and you always want to see more videos of it. So yeah, that's what I'm doing today. So this today is a super simple tutorial on how to do eyeshadow for hooded eyes, how to do makeup for hooded eyes, how to do eye makeup for hooded eyes, whatever you care to call this. Um, that's what it is. It's a very simple look. This is it right here. It's an everyday natural, everyday wearable look. So if you have hooded eyes, this can be your new go-to makeup look. It can be like your makeup routine, whatever you want. Um, I did a lot of warm tones. I did some cool tones, not heavy on the liner. It's very natural, very everyday, very go-to, very neutral, very effortless. If you guys are new to my channel and you want to join the Starling fan, be sure to hit the subscribe button down below. I would love to have you guys. I'm uploading a ton of videos this month and next month as well. So I know you guys uh, won't want to miss out so subscribe and if you guys want notifications be sure to hit the bell and I think you get notified every time which is pretty cool so yeah I'm gonna stop rambling and let's get on with the video all of these shadows today that I'm using are MAC shadows but just know that they're like neutral tones and you, you don't have to use MAC shadows you can use any eyeshadow that you want. I'm going to go in with a blending brush. This is a MAC 224. It's just a big fluffy blending brush and I'm going to go in right here with this shade called soft brown so for this shade, instead of holding your brush going like this, because what that can actually do is transfer the color onto your lid, and we're trying to make your lids look a little bit bigger here. So instead of going like dead on or like this, we're actually going to hold it up on an angle. So it creates a little bit of a cut crease. Now cut creases are like the best way to make your lids look bigger if you have small lids or hooded eyes. Um, and I do have an entire video on like how to do a cut crease if you have hooded eyes, so I'll have that link down below. But doing this technique is just going to, it's going to lift up your eye. Like if you can already see the difference a little bit, it just leaves your lid space open. And then it just shades in your crease and contours it a little bit while really not putting in any effort to do so. I'm going to take a MAC 222. I think this is discontinued. And I'm going to take this shade. I forget the name off the top of my head, so it's going to be right here on the screen. I think it's supposed to be the T, but like I could be so off. So I'm going to take this on my 222. And we're just going to build up the crease. So I'm just going to do the same thing, except I'm just going to keep this on the outer part of the eye. And then go back in with my 224 and blend that out. I always like to even out the upper and lower lashes, so I'm just going to run a little bit of shadow underneath my lower lash line to, you know, blend the two. Then I'm going to go in with this shade here. Again, the name is escaping me, so it's going to be on the screen. And this is a MAC 217 brush. You can use the same brush. I'm just bougie and I like to switch out my brushes. So I'm just taking a little tiny bit of this and we're going to do the same deal. Just build it right here on the outer corner with our brush going up, but this time I'm taking it in just a little bit more just to give my eye a little bit of depth all over. So pretty much the technique and the trick to making your lids look bigger is to just keep adding depth into your crease so that it looks like it's being sunken back more and more and more so that your lid space looks bigger and bigger and bigger. But this technique is just going to kind of like trick the eye a little bit. All right, now onto the lid. You can use whatever lid color you want. I'm going in here with Blanc Type. This is just on a flat shader brush and I'm just going to pat this on my lid and I'm going to kind of bring it up a little bit higher than I normally would. It's okay if this is messy because you're just going to blend it back out anyway. But yeah, this is going on my lid and normally I take it to about here, but as you can see, I'm bringing it up higher a little bit. Going back in with the blending brush and blending that out. Still letting my brush on this angle so we get that little crease. A little mild cut crease action going on. For liner, I have an entire video on how to do winged eyeliner for hooded eyes, which I'll also have linked down below. Um, but for this look, I'm just going to keep it really simple and go with that outer brick red tone that we use and just pat this on the outer corner of our eye. You definitely don't want to bring it up too high and you don't want to bring it in because this is just going to smoke out the lash line a little bit but you definitely want to keep your eyes as open as possible then on that same little brush I'm just going to mix the two names that I forgot and that we put on the outer corner and I'm just going to smudge this along my lower lash line then the last thing that we're going to do is put on some mascara um, you can put on false eyelashes if you want. I have an entire video on how to apply false eyelashes. Link down below if you care to check it out. This is Benefit They're Real. This has been my favorite mascara lately. I just have mascara on the side and I think it looks pretty good. 
but I literally also ripped out like 20 lashes right before I put mascara on the side by accident. I didn't even mean to. I was just like declumping my leftover mascara and I pulled out like a huge clump of eyelashes and I was like, well, that sucks. So to make my eyes and lids appear bigger, I am curling my eyelashes, which I already did. Because that's just going to lift up my eyelashes and make my eyes appear larger. And then I'm not putting any like legit eyeliner. I didn't. I just used eyeshadow. Um, I'm not putting on any eyeliner because that's actually going to close off our eyes. And I want them to be nice and big and to kind of counteract with the hooded lids. So I'm putting mascara on my upper lashes as well as on my lower lashes, but keeping it liner free. You can put a white in your waterline if you want, but I like to just keep it natural. All right, and there you have it. Thank you guys so much. I really hope you all enjoyed this video. If you did, be sure to give it a thumbs up and also let me know in the comments down below what your favorite hooded eye tip is. And uh, yeah, if you guys wanna see my last upload, that's right here, and if you guys wanna see um, my last cut crease for her device video, that's right here. Love you guys so much, and I'll talk to you in my next video. Bye!